anything. Nobody owes you anything, you know, like, and and you and I both know the stats of how many small businesses fail in that first 12 to 24 months. Yeah. Less of those than, than not, though, I think fail because they haven't fully committed or whatever. Like, I feel like the ones who who really commit, who who burn the boats, you know, as they say, like, uh, and they're like, okay, this is it. This is this has got to be it. Mm. Um, I feel like the, the the percentage of those ones are actually better, maybe. I have no data to support that, and you know that's important to me. Um, <laughs> but, you know, uh, you know, maybe that's... Maybe that's a, a true stat. I, I would like to know that. You know, how many people who are who have burned the boats fail compared to how many people are like a foot in each camp failing? Exactly, exactly. And even then, what failing is, right? I've just used that word again. Yeah, totally. Like, what does that mean? Like, if you if you're still in business four years later, but you've not drawn a wage yet, mm-hmm. as the founder of your startup, are you failing? Um, if you if you are making heaps of money but hating it. Mm. Are you, are you failing? Like there's, yeah. it's such a subjective thing. And I think mm. so many of us though, take the objective view of, well, I need this much money or I need to be killing it or I need to be on TV yeah. or I need to whatever. Yeah. Um, yeah. Otherwise I'm I'm failing yeah. and I'm a failure. Yeah. And I think it goes the same thing for your definition of success as well. It's like what's your definition of, of failure and what is your definition of success? You know, success could mean that you're earning the same amount of money in your own business, but you're working half the amount of time or you're actually just enjoying what you're doing or you have a seven figure business or an eight figure business or whatever that means for you. Um, or you just get to spend more time with your family. So it really just depends on the individual. So I love that.